Hi everyone, I'm Megan Mullerton for CNET Appliances and this is a review of the iRobot Roomba 880. This little guy looks a lot like some of its predecessors. It has that classic Roomba shape, the sensor at the top. It has that kind of wonky handle that you use to carry it from place to place. And so at first glance, there isn't much different about this new 800 series. But flip it over and you'll see a really unique new feature. Some of this is still the same. There's still this spinner rotator thing that pulls in the debris, but the main difference is what iRobot calls the extractor. And the extractor is this part underneath. That's what really gets the debris sucked up into the dustbin. This is the 790 model for $699 that's on iRobot's website right now. The big difference is that it has brushes underneath and this one has rubbery, what they call extractors. And it really seems to make a big difference. It really does outperform the 790. Some of it's marginal, but for pet hair, it does a lot better. Like the 790 Roomba, this one is also $699. And it's the very first model they're introducing to the 800 series. I'm not sure if they're gonna be phasing out the 790 since this one does perform better and they're the same price, but I do really like this new model a lot and I would recommend it over the 790. This little guy still won't replace your upright model, but if you want some day-to-day -day maintenance, something that can get under your bed or other areas, this is a great option. I'm Megan Woolerton for CNET Appliances, and this has been a review of the iRobot Roomba 880.